Diana, you are chasing the presidential race in 2016. I know you've got a candidate here now. Is it Hillary? Is it Trump? <laughs> Who do you got? Definitely not Hillary. <laughs> if one thing, <laughs> maybe, maybe Trump. Yeah, maybe Trump. I love that reaction. If one thing is clear this political season, voters are craving new faces. Here in studio, we have one entrepreneur hoping he could be that candidate. Mr. Rod Silva. He's a New Jersey local running as an independent candidate for the 2016 presidential race. You may not recognize his name, but you'll likely be familiar with his string of restaurants, Muscle Maker Grill. They're all built on the mission of providing great food with your health in mind, and now he's carrying that motto over to politics. So let's jump into it. Okay. What's the message? Make America healthy again. Listen, the biggest issue we face as Americans is that we're not being healthy. 74 million so people affected by heart So do you support the First disease. Lady's program, the school lunch program, all the healthy stuff that the kids are throwing in the trash? I support it. I think she had a great start, but I think it's way bigger than that. I think it's the people. You know, you can't have the tail wagging the dog. My kid's not going to come up to me and say, you know, I don't want McDonald's today, and not offense to them, I want broccoli. You know, you have to lead the way. But would you keep yeah. Obamacare? Well, Obamacare, none of the health cares are going to work when it's all bankrupt. What do you have to do is you have to make America healthy. So th the burden isn't on. It, it costs just one thing. High blood pressure costs $49 You think million maybe there should be some kind of mandatory health program for people? Well, Kids get up in the morning, do calisthenics? I, I'm not a big federal government being big brother, right? So I think it's about education. There's so, so many things that our health care system already already does that they're not being used, they're not being explained. Gym memberships are are given, nutritionists, right? Speak to the health care advisor. Say, let's do preventive care. Let's talk to people about natural herbs, natural vitamins that will help, you know, keep you healthy. Would you have the federal you government sick. subsidize those memberships? Like, well, like higher education, we'd have like a budget for... Majority of the health care in this country right now has that in their plans, right? So yes, if you make them healthier, it's cheaper to keep them than it is to wait for one we're not you know, feeling well. Thanks, Rod. Appreciate you.